Hi guys, this video is to show you about the accuracy of the rain gauge of the Accurite 01021M caller weather station with rain gauge lightning sensor. So as you can see this weather station comes with three parts, it has a nice caller weather display and the thermometer like the temperature sensor and including the lightning detector and it also comes with the third part that's the rain gauge so this is actually a good thing that it comes with two different sensors because usually you want to place the rain gauge where it gets all the rain and that's usually also a place where it gets a lot of sun and that means you want to place your uh, temperature sensor at a different place like in a nice shady place so that's a really good thing i, I like this really much uh, but you have to be aware that's a standalone weather station it's not connected to the internet and yeah so you don't get any like nice charts or lot of history it has some history data on the display but not really nice charts but it's okay i mean i'm good with that and because it comes with a really low price and after a couple of years usually these kind of weather stations are, yeah, they are pretty much, um, yeah, at end of life cycle after a couple of years because they are outside sun, rain, cold, freeze, everything, and then you have to replace them. And I'm tired of paying a couple of hundred bucks every couple of years. So uh, that's pretty good. And yeah. So we had a lot of rain last night, actually 24.13 millimeters, which is very close to one inch. So now I was interested to see how accurate that is. So I went to this current weather site of the United States, which has this nice side where you can look up the rain from last couple of hours days weeks whatever whatever so i checked la rain uh, for the last 24 hours which matches the display uh, duration so and yeah i have found out that it, our area is the in the intermediate green which means it should be between 0 0.75 and 1 inch so I mean it's hard to guess what it is exactly I mean this is just an accumulation based on the rain rudder and uh, not super accurate but I think it has a proven record and it should shouldn't be uh, off the chart so um, yeah I think this is a quite good reference of course you could check with a uh, second uh, rain gauge or something like that or put a glass outside maybe probably I will do this at some point but for a quick check I think this is quite good for me it's enough and yeah if you think that your rain gauge isn't accurate enough you can adjust there are two screws uh, inside you can open that adjust the screws and you will have uh, even more accuracy so that's it for now I hope I was able to help you a little bit with that if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching see you next time